A lot of times I talk about the personality can be found in the kitchen and this kitchen has a lot of personality poppers. Stay tuned. It's Amy with Heart and Home Orlando and today we're taking a look at another beautiful Arthur Ruttenberg home. We are out here in Melbourne, Florida at a lovely community called um, Adelaide in Vieira. This is a beautiful gated community out here in Vieira which is um, in Melbourne and it is a gorgeous community. 2,742 square feet, four bedrooms and this has a beautiful pool area. So this is a beautiful model home. I love the layout and I think you're probably going to like the finish on this as well. In fact, I absolutely love the countertops. I can't wait to show them to you. So just to go through the tour, we're going to kind of walk through the flow of the home where everything is laid out. So this home is staged. It's not a fully decorated model, but this is a staged model home. And we are getting, by the way, sneak peeks. So they are probably 99.99% done. And this home is going to be gorgeous as soon as you come out here to see it in person. Okay. So you have this lovely foyer entryway. Now, when you come in, you're main hub of the home is right here but look at that that pool area is beautiful when we see that pool up close I have to tell you take note of that design because it's a really smart layout to get you everything you want in your own pool area so you have your family room space right here open and connected to your kitchen but right back behind me is what we want to refer to either as your flex space or maybe even your office space you can see here they have it staged as an office but when you really think about you and your family and how you would need to utilize the square footage in the rooms here in this home how would you use that room would it be a playroom for young kids would it be an office would it be a lounge would it be a reading nook or a library music room so many different options and I love that they've done the full private French doors for this because it really does make that room private for whatever purpose you intend to use it okay so family room space love the tray ceilings up here it's almost like it's a double tray so you have tray and then a tray again look at the magnificent lighting fixtures here in this home <laughs> those are super cool definitely unique and I talk a lot about places where you can have your pop of personality in your home and that your uh, pendant lights is part of it that is definitely a personality popper right there I love it speaking of personality poppers look at this counter I love this counter the black and the white contrast with the wavy design love 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 this this is a beautiful kitchen and take a look at all of your cabinet and counter space so you have the darker cabinets you've got your um, really beautiful now this this backsplash is deceiving in some light it looks gray and in others it looks like a sea foam it is so beautiful and really eye-catching again personality popper right there backsplash and pendant lights beautiful so this is a gas community I want to make sure I mention that because if it's important to you we can take note of that. So gourmet kitchen option, meaning you've got your, um, you know, your microwave or convection up above. You've got a full oven here, plenty of cabinet and counter space here on this island. And speaking of plenty of space, look over there. This, um, the, the eat in area, your, I won't even say breakfast nook because it's not a nook. This, a nook kind of indicates that it's a little bit smaller, more intimate and cozy. This is actually quite grand and quite lovely. So you have a lot of space here. You know, we talk a lot about how formal living rooms are are kind of gone and that we tend to use more semi-formal um, eating areas now this room is actually perfect because it allows you enough space that you can extend your table you can seat quite a large crew but you've also got wall space so if you do have that buffet and that hutch or some kind of a treatment you want to do to display some of your special serving dishes you've got that option all right let's come back down this hallway because there's a lot to see right so we're going to come back down this direction so right over here you're going to have your um you've got your kitchen area here you've got your big walk-in pantry there so nice big pantry and then continuing down this hall and this is kind of the whole entry hallway because the, the garage is back over there so this is an ensuite so over here quiet nice tucked away and private you have this lovely nice size bedroom with its own private bathroom so you have the private um, you know the toilet tub sink shower um, this is just the shower stall and there no tub and a nice big closet as well continuing back down the hallway over here to my left 
to your right, you're going to have your laundry room. So you have lots of beautiful space in here, usable space in here. Love the, again, the darker cabinet, the whiter counters, and I love the utility sink. Such a smart thing to be able to add. And in here, again, Arthur Ruddenberg, a custom builder. There are so many beautiful options and upgrades, but even here in the cabinets, they've done the crown molding on top of the cabinet. It's those touches that make this builder different from some of the other more traditional production builders. All right, so over here, you're going to have your AC handler. Back over here, you're going to have your garage, which we kind of saw in the front exterior. And then over here, you're going to have an additional really large storage area. You know, we don't have basements here in Florida, and we can't typically store anything on our attic, so the additional storage is very welcomed and really wanted. Okay, so bedroom over there. So that was bedroom number one. If we continue back down this hallway through the kitchen, back down this hallway, you're going to have the other two bedrooms that are going to have another bathroom to share. So let's hit this bedroom first. Nice big bedroom. Again, tall ceilings. You've got beautiful doors here with this big closet. It's a big, it's a, like a larger oversized reach in closet. Really nice. Lots of space, lots of square footage and lots of usable wall space in here. If you want to situate your furniture. You have a full bath over here. Again, beautiful. Look at the tile work in that shower. So I love that. That is your tub on the bottom. You've got the shower door on it, but if you look at the tile work and like that Listello band that goes up the middle, really nice. Tucked back over here, you have the additional bedroom. So now we have seen our three guest or children's bedrooms. Again, you don't have to use them as bedrooms. Maybe you want to use, use one of these as an office or a game room or a playroom and use that front room for something else. But you have three essential guest rooms all on this side of the home that allows you that privacy. So real quick, let's take a peek out here at the outdoor living space and then we'll check the master so what I like about this pool by the way um, if you like this pool this is to give you a point of reference if you like this pool the uh, the lanai space and the screen it was about sixty three thousand dollars for all of this I actually thought that was kind of low now that's not to guarantee you that price but it's a point of reference because people ask me all the time how much does it cost to build a pool so this pool is beautiful it's a rectangular shape so it doesn't have all the curves but you have a large sun shelf here Two more steps down, you have your swimming area here. That whole back side has a bench, a seat all along the back side of it. And this whole rectangular section here is your actual spa area, which is, and by the way, it has a seat all the way around it as well. So this is really, really nice. I love the outdoor space. This is uncovered, but covered with a lana, or covered with the screen, but this is covered with your roof line here. So this one is completely covered to the elements as far as rain. This one also has the summer kitchen. It's already set up for a TV up above. And again, you've got additional dining and seating area out here if you want to enjoy your outdoor space, which of course, when you live in Florida, you're gonna enjoy your outdoor space. All right, let's take a peek back over here at this master bedroom. So remember, as a one-story home, there's 2,742, I believe, square feet here in this home. So it's a really large one-story home. Speaking of large, this bedroom, this master bedroom is really large. I love these two windows right here that give you a beautiful view of that outdoor living space so that every morning when you wake up, you take a glance over to the side and you see such a beautiful sight to start your day and you can go, okay, you know what? Based on that view, I can get up and go to work today. So there you go. All right, master bathroom back over here again. Spectacular. Everything that Arthur Ruttenberg does really has that touch of elegance and a little bit of luxury in there, right? This is no exception. Beautiful, beautiful master bathroom. Again, I love the design touches that they've done here. The cabinets, you've got the white cabinets. It looks like you've got the chrome hardware, beautiful um, granite countertops, the freestanding tub, and the shower, which is a total walk-in shower over here. There's no door whatsoever. Really nice. So big shower over here, and then, of course, over here. Look at this. I love this. I want this right here. I want this. What a great master closet. This is fabulous. Lots of shelving, shoe shelving, hanging, folding, stacking, piling, 
organizing, oh my goodness, organizing your clothes so that you can see everything. And then to have this extra little bonus here, which is just a beautiful functional, but also a little decorative touch because you're gonna see that as soon as you open that door and look all the way through. So separate his and her vanities, private door for the toilet. And there you have it, my friends, the Catalina. Remember, we are here um, out in Melbourne today, actually at Adelaide and Vieira, and we are touring this amazing community with an amazing builder. And remember that with Arthur Ruttenberg, and remember, I don't work for or represent Arthur Ruttenberg, but I've toured many of their homes and in every single case, they are absolutely off the chart spectacular. They are beautiful. There's attention to detail, the quality of construction, and the possibilities are endless when you work with a builder like Arthur Ruttenberg, where you can just kind of take your your ideas and help and, and have them help you make that into your actual dream home all right guys thank you for staying with me today i hope you stay safe and you stay well please make sure if you haven't already subscribed to this youtube channel make sure you call me 407-848-8042 so that i can tell you all about the heart and home orlando incentive that you have here if you use me as your buyer agent with one of these homes all right guys have a great day stay safe stay well happy house hunting